On this week's episode of Hashtag Almost 30, I'm going to make a peep. It's not going to be any old peep. I am going to be making a ginormous peep. Easter's not Easter without a peep. The peep recipes I looked up include gelatin and you're supposed to make your own marshmallow. I don't have gelatin. I do have marshmallows. Chicks are my favorite peep. I like to have a little thin marshmallow here and then fat marshmallow here. That's my thing. The bunnies are all right. If you eat ear for ear, it's fine, I guess. No. That's what I'm talking about. In order to make colored sugar, I assume you add food coloring. So that's what I'm going to do. That's a good amount of sugar. I'm going to make a pink peep, hopefully. Well, kind of just turned the food coloring into solid. It's just one solid chunk of red now. I think it just needs a lot of good stirring. Again, I added way too much food coloring. Yep, just good stirring will get to it. How do you judge these things? Marshmallows are essentially just sugar, so if I heat it up, I'm afraid that it's just going to stick the pan. I'm going to add some cooking spray. These marshmallows have been in there a while. Hopefully they melt fine. Oh, the marshmallow's just burning. These are gonna be campfire flavored. I really wanna throw some Rice Krispies in here. It kinda smells like Disneyland. Marshmallow everywhere. It's not cooling. That's just amazing. I don't know if this is going to work. I don't even know what marshmallows are made of. I think it's just sugar. Cornstarch, water, gelatin. I should have just made my own marshmallow. It's getting so brown. I'm going to try to layer it. No, it's just one brown thing. This is really good though. It just keeps spreading. It looks like my peep died. This is just mess. It's like glue. A tasty never ending glue mess. I don't even know what else to do. I am not a peep maker. I am a really good almost circle maker. It's literally just stuck to the paper. I poured the marshmallow on the non-waxy side of the paper. So I thought maybe if I added sugar to... All hope is not lost. This is a marshmallow ball. How many of you can say that you've held a marshmallow ball? I'm gonna pretend it's like pizza dough. It just keeps trying to flatten because it's hot still. Beak keeps getting longer and longer. It's my peep, I'll do what I want. I have heard rumor that if you put a peep in the microwave, it'll become large. That might be easier. This is going to be so hard to clean. Oh my gosh, it worked! Who'd have thought? I never thought. I'm gonna keep going, see what happens. They're huge. That would have been so much easier. Here's my peep. It's a little flatter than your average peep. I'm gonna say that's not bad. I'm gonna try it. It doesn't quite have the same appeal as the normal little peep because it just doesn't taste very good. Kind of looks like a deflated alien baby. Hi, Meaty's daughter. Is this what taffy is like? This peep looks way better. I just pulled it like it was taffy. Peep. It kind of looks like a snake. Who says snakes aren't around Easter time? Snake peep. It's better than the alien baby peep. That one was scary. And these ones just completely deflated. Oh my gosh, they're solid. They're kind of like a lucky charm. On this week's episode of Hashtag Almost 30, I learned if you microwave a peep, it will expand. I learned that you could pull marshmallow into almost taffy. I learned that adding food coloring to sugar colors the sugar, but it's kind of ugly looking. And maybe I'm just not good at molding things. Speaking of molding, it took about a week to dry, but I made a pot slash bowl thing. And look at, there's even pink peep sugar in it. The end. Sometimes what you think is gonna be a failure is only a light failure. You know what? It's better to buy drinks from your home than to buy drinks from your not home.